y'all it's juvie and on this episode of off the shots we have the one and only Adriana. what's good what's good okay so tell the people where you from how old you are i'm from here i'm from beaumont texas i'm from the north end and um i'm 22 i just turned 22. Okay, congratulations. Happy Thank late birthday, you. world. <laughs> so, let's just go ahead and get into these questions. But before we get into the questions, let's go ahead and take a shot. Oh, for sure. Mm -hmm. So, cheers to New Life 22. Oh. And... Mm. Yeah, baby. That Luna make it look. Lindsay. Mm. Mm -hmm. mm. Okay, so, you already know. We like to spell over here. Spell. So, oh, like spelling bee? No, we ain't gonna do. We ain't gonna hit you with a spelling bee. Oh, I'm like, what? Spelling bee, but we are gonna hit you with a little bit of, you know. Okay. So, how do you spell tuna? T u n a. How do you spell sub? S u b. Okay, now put those words together, and what does it spell backwards? What? Wait, wait, <laughs> wait. Put them together, and what does it spell backwards? Yes. What the fuck? Bro, I'm not slow, bro. Hold on. Tuna sub? <laughs> like Tuna what? sub spelled like, backwards. What? Tuna sub spelled backwards. But... What the <laughs> fuck? What did you got to say? It? It, what, is it... Bro, is it bust a nut, bro? It is bust oh a nut. Oh, my God. <laughs> okay, so at first, look, she wasn't scared to say it, but it is bust a nut, baby. Okay, so. Wow, that's crazy. Call your pops and tell him you're pregnant or take a shot. But <laughs> you got you can't be like, it's a prank, it's a prank. No. For the rest of the interview, your daddy think you're pregnant. Ma'am, do you know who my father is? <laughs> do you know who your father is? What you gonna do? You pussy. He gonna, he gonna have an aneurysm. What you gonna do? Oh you gonna take that shot or you gonna let it rot? He probably not gonna believe me. I ain't gonna lie. All right, I'm gonna call him. I'm gonna call him. Oh my God. I'm gonna call him. Okay. Am I in distress or I'm just like, look, I've been keeping it a secret. And... You gonna have to decide, but it's quick. Two minutes. You put him on the phone, hang up. No explanation, no nothing. I'm pregnant. Gotta go. He's gonna be blowing it. Not the father. I'm scared. I ain't gonna say nothing. What if you don't answer? Then you gotta call your mama. Then I'm gonna be like, wow, you're fake. <laughs> he probably in the storm. Hello? Oh. Hello? Hello? Yes. Um, I have some news to share. What's going on? Uh, what job did you land? No, it's not about a job. Okay, what is it about? Um, so, um, I think I'm pregnant. You gotta hang up after the two. <laughs> and you can't answer it now. Put your phone on, do not disturb. And throw your phone he right over there. Tweak out. It is what it Look. is. My dear father, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Let's I didn't want to, yeah. <laughs> How sorry she really is when she get <laughs> home, huh? All right, y'all. Now, you are very known on Instagram. You a hottie Literally. with the body, okay? Just a little bit. So you know. I know they be in them DMs. Now, name a celebrity that's been in them DMs or take a shot. Y'all is Fucking federal. <laughs> oh, my dad's calling me back. Father, and she not lying, y'all. He is calling. He's probably like, what? He's here. What? Oh, shit. Mm. Influencer. It ain't got to be, you know. In, and nowadays, Influencer, shit, everybody is celebrity. celebrity. I ain't gonna lie. I'm gonna take a shot. Let's take the shot. She probably okay. in a relationship with this man. I'm they probably gonna... together. I'm going to take the shot. Oh, no. I'm very much single. Oh, okay. And I'm glad. So, you are single. So, what will it be like for a man? Uh, baby, take the shot, baby. We ain't. <laughs> she tried it. She tried it. <laughs> but what would it take for a man to win you since you did say you are single? Um, hmm. 
That's a good question. I think like Girl, your daddy is blowing that phone. Oh my gosh. Uh. <laughs> I feel so bad. <laughs> I feel so bad. <laughs> but um I guess I don't think I'm a person that can be won over because the people that I have dealt with, like 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 you said, like the DMs is flooded. True. And people just be trying to run game, talk they talk, but it's like I done seen a lot, I done did a lot, like none of that shit really impressed me. Right. So you either just you either for me or you not. Like I either gotta be feeling you or I'm just like I'm cool off of you. So Right. Right now, like, I ain't gonna I'm not even thinking about a man. What what is that? I'm, and I'm I can, trying to get to the bag. Like. Oh, period. We is not worried about no nigga. We is getting about that. in that. We get into that skrilla. Okay. So I do know that I seen you are not producing or filming. Are you a part of the casting that's happening right now with the new short film? Are you a part of it or are you? Yes, I'm. Um, actually, one of the lead female roles on... It's actually a series. It's mm-hmm. a short series. Okay. And um, I'm actually going to a rehearsal after this. Mm-hmm. And I'm just really excited about it. It's a lot of black creatives around Beaumont who are actually a part of it. And I just... I can't wait for people to see it because it's going to be really good. It's um, directed by uh, Roderick McCartney and Denzel Seal. Mm-hmm. And I did see that. And I'm very excited, girl. I was thinking about pulling up too. Probably fake crying a Girl, come just to the casting call. I'm trying to get. I'm trying to get out of the bed. You feel me? So yeah, we can make it to uh, Tyler Perry Studios. Okay, bitch. we going to. Okay, but since you are an actress, now that you're saying you the lead, you should know these famous lines. Okay. Okay. So this one is from. Oh my god, her dad is really blowing up her phone. <laughs> okay, should she really just answer for him? Because he is really blowing her fucking phone up for real. Okay, answer it. Tell him, baby, I'll play it. Because he is blowing her shit up. Hello? Hello? I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, it's a prank. It's a prank. I had to do it. I'm I'm filming something right now, and it was either do that or take a shot. I'm sorry. He said, "Fool, don't play with me like that." I'm scared of him. Okay, Dude, we ain't playing with your daddy no more. I'm. I know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Thank you for the heart attack today. I appreciate it. You're welcome. We had to boost you up after this hurricane we just had. Yeah. But don't, but don't worry. Since we in the pranking Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Yeah. No. Yeah. No. Yeah. We didn't start it over. I'm war. not coming home. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, I'll talk to you later. Aw. Okay. All right. So I'm just gonna pour this one just in case you get it wrong because you know some people just don't know. He's finna get me so. Oh my god. So since you said you are a famous actress, well you finna be a famous finna actress. Finna be, girl. Not yet. In the making. Okay, but it's coming. I'm gonna speak it into existence for you. We gonna Period. practice some of these famous lines. Okay. And if you don't get these, these is from movies that we all watched. So if you don't get this right. Baby, you're going to have to take some more shots, okay? So, okay. the first one is, if you don't know this, go ahead and just pick up the glass. Life is like a box of... Chocolates. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so this one is kind of hard. Your mom's so stupid, she called Dr. Dre to get a pass mare. Hello, Dr. Dre, my pussy's doing a beatbox. I don't know what come after that. Ain't that from... Ain't that from White Chicks? Yes! Oh, okay. At least you got it right. Okay. At least you got it right. (laughs) She ain't got to take the shot, y'all. A lot of people didn't know that one. So, this one I did see, you know, just from stalking you a little bit. Mm. Mm. I did see you had some famous people on your walls. And you are into music, so let's see if you can finish these lyrics, okay? Mm -hmm. It's hell on earth and the city's on fire. The song was on your wall. <laughs> what? What song? 
wrong with that? Solo by Frank Ocean. It's hell on earth and the city's oh, on fire. Oh, I don't know that song. I'm gonna take a shot with her because ooh. take that damn thing off your wall. I'm finna, I'm finna block. That's it. not what song is on there. Why you don't know the damn song if you got an album though? The song that's on my wall is Ivy by Frank Ocean. Oh lord, you wanted them. You wanted them. <laughs> that's cute though. So, just going into trending topics, we talking about music. Mm-hmm. Drake and Kendrick back to back. Back to back. Who you going for, first of all? And keep it real. I'm going to be so real with you. I have not been keeping up with their beef. It's been, first of all, it's been going on for too long. Like, just kiss already. I didn't know that I they were beefing until Future came out and was like, fuck you, bitch. Yeah, it's just kind of like everybody's beefing with everybody right now. It's like, damn, like, I need to, Come I don't know, head. like, take a shot, chill. Mm, I, I feel know. like they need to fight. Everybody making these songs gonna... <laughs> going bar for bar, <laughs> lyric for lyric. Let's go glove for glove, fist I, for fist. I ain't gonna lie, if it was a boxing match between both of them, I would watch. I would I would pay money. Who do you think will win? In a fight? Kendrick. Kendrick or Drake? Kendrick, for sure. Drake. I'm sorry. Drake might have somebody jump in the fight for him, mm-hmm. but as far as going hard, I doubt it. Yeah, now... Speaking of fighting, Ryan Garcia just got hit with one of the offenses that we just can't get. So supposedly he was taking PED steroids. Wait, 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 what? For real? So well, not supposed. Well, suppose I'm gonna say allegedly because we still haven't had the actual real people come out and say this. But ESPN posted about it. Everybody's been posting that Ryan basically had got tested. Before the fight, and then they had found that he did take a steroid. But my thing is, do you think that he should get disqualified for that, or do you feel like shit? It is what it is. I ain't gonna lie, the fight is over, and I feel like let's say let's say he did take the steroid. I don't think he did. I feel like they just because he's from he's. I've never seen somebody talk so much shit about a fight before ever in my life. Exactly. And niggas was really like doubting this man. Like, exactly. Like, oh, he gonna get his ass whooped. And look what he did. I'm just, I just feel like for a person who talked that most, the most shit like that, you literally like don't you have gotta no back that but shit to up. Win. You have no choice but to win. So I knew he was gonna win, but the steroids, they just saying. They just yeah. Exactly. That's what I feel. Devin, I think I feel like Devin is just a sore loser. In the beginning, Devin had him. He had him in the first quarter, and then at the end, the nigga lost. But did you? Fair but square. did you see how he was like? How he had him? Like how he was doing him? Like he was really doing him. Bad. No, that's what I'm saying. I, I literally was telling was everybody. I was like, bad. bro, if you see Devin's face after the fight, Devin's face never looked it like that after no fight. And if you see on IG, like Ryan, he's he's still posting. To he's this still day, going hard to this day. He's still posting. So I ain't gonna lie. If it was me and I lost the fight and the nigga I lost to, he just posts about it every single day. I would be pissed I'm off. Gonna, too. I'm gonna I'm gonna try to get you canceled too because you talking too much, like let it go. And speaking of something to prove, let's talk about baby storm. Cause girl, I'm telling you, for the last two weeks, this girl has been going back to back to back with everybody. She exposing everybody in the industry. Illuminati this, colorism this. Uh, Nicki Minaj, JT, Cardi B, nobody likes me. I don't know what's going on, but I know that she said I spices in the Illuminati. Look. It's getting Boom. hot in here. This is my thing. What the fuck are we supposed to do with that information? Exactly. <laughs> what, are, what does she want us to do with that information? Like, what you want us to do? Start a rebellion and go, like, raid these niggas? Like... What are we supposed to do with that? Let's say it's all true. And I don't know. I ain't gonna lie. Know. I've been on that. I had to block her. It was real. I blocked her on Twitter. I, I couldn't do it no more. I Everybody got... been posting about that girl. I never even knew who she was until 
she started exposing people and yeah. then she's just been constantly on the TL type I've, shit. I've been seeing that shit against my will. I don't appreciate that at all. <laughs> Bro, ever since Elon got a hold of Twitter, I've been seeing a whole bunch of shit against my will. From fights, I don't know how many goddamn fights I'm going to see on my timeline. This ain't even my For You page anymore. Like, I don't know what this is. Like, no. Elon, just give us back Twitter. We can't do X anymore. Please. And then please ban Baby Storm because she's she's going on a rampage Shoddy, right now. Shawty tweaking out. She tweaking. I hope, I hope it gets better for her. But do Look you out. feel like she's lying? I ain't gonna lie. I'm like 50-50 with it because... The industry is fucked up. I was finna say, because you, <laughs> you know, you getting into it. So you kind of seeing things are, you know, you know how the industry is. They really is a part. They worshiping that devil. The, the, what they doing back there? You been signing look, NDAs, bitch? Look, I don't, I don't know shit about shit. I just know the industry is, it's fucked up. And at the end of the day, like, you have a choice. You right. always have a choice on what you want to partake in. That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> all right, girl. Now, if I see your ass <laughs> up there, I'm going to be like, all right, my bitch, she didn't. She, she didn't chose her path. I'm just saying. No. I know that she's going to choose the right path. But speaking of the right path, let's choose the path of love. Okay. Ruby and Drewski. I love me some Drewski. Okay. He can do no wrong. But I don't know what the fuck is going on with this Ruby Rose <laughs> shit. I ain't gonna lie. Look, is this real? You know, you gotta think of it as like, it's Drewski. And it's Ruby Rose. There's no way he not dropping a bag on her. Like, there's no way he's not dropping a bag on her. And I really feel like mm. the people fuck with it. It's getting publicity. So if it was me, I'd be like... Yeah, I'm finna fuck with this funny ass nigga. Like, okay, it's bringing me good publicity. He probably really like her because she a bad bitch. I was so. gonna say she's bad. <laughs> I a think bad Drewski is so real. nice though. I don't. I hope that it's not for publicity. I hope that it really is for love because Drewski is so. He is funny than a bitch. I love funny people. Drewski funny than a bitch, and he just bring people joy. So if she break my nigga heart on oh God, I'm gonna beat the fuck out of her. Wait, so you think it's real? That ass is. You think that's real? I don't think it's real. <laughs> I don't think it's real. Okay, I don't think it's real, you guys. I think that it's fake. I think it's literally for show. But then at the same time, I've never seen Drewski do no no shit for show. That's I see true. Ruby do a lot of shit for show. So I don't know, you know, I don't know her. But I don't know, you know, if that's real or not. But I know that Drewski don't do no publicity shit. He funny. He can just make a fucking comedy skit and get some fans. You know what I'm yeah. saying? He don't need a bitch to make him go up. Ruby always needed that type of shit. You know, her shit is sex appeal, you know what I'm saying? But it's different. That's why I feel like it could be real because it's random as fuck. Like, Drewski and Ruby, who the hell would have thought yeah, of that, that shit? shit? You know what random. I'm saying? There's a lot of girls who do think Drewski is fine, though. I, I am not is. one of them girls. What? But, oh, I mean, you you think he fine? I like Drewski. I think he fine. I, but everybody know me since I since since high school. Everybody know I like big dudes. I my oh. first boyfriend, he was a heavy set. He was the love of my life, girl. I love oh. him chubby. I'm small. I need a nigga that can cuddle me and make me warm. Okay. I can't be shocked up with no bones. Okay. Sorry. I feel that. I like them. I like them big and thick. Yeah, I don't like skinny dudes. I like like you gotta have some muscle. But that's because I'm a I'm an athlete. I was just gonna so say. Like, she need an NFL player. Any oh, NFL? no. Oh, oop. Stay far the fuck away from me for the rest of your life. Now that we did, we <laughs> fucked with an NFL player before. Story time. I plead the fifth. Take I a shot. I plead the fifth. She got to take a shot for take, that I'll How take she going to tell us? Oh, fuck the NFL I'll, players. But she don't want to give us a story time. She ain't even got to say no name. She could just be like, look. Da -da 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 -da. Okay, I'm going to take the shot and I'm going to speak. A little bit. Just Speak your truth, sister. Because what's wrong with NFL players? Because last time I uh, heard, well, let me shut the fuck up. <laughs> let what? me shut the fuck up. What? I mean, shit. I don't know. What's up? <laughs> Come okay. on. Tell me something. I'm going a, I'm to a, I'm a just say this. Their lifestyle, it looks great. Mm. It's cute. You know, bitches want to be like Jada Way to woo the woo. But when you get in there, you get in there? It's a cult. You're going to be fighting for your fucking life. And me personally, 
I ain't got that much fight in me. So y'all can have that shit. I, I could care less. I could care less. I'd rather be a single and happy than fucking rich as fuck and miserable. Miserable, than a bitch. miserable as fuck. And it's too many niggas in the world. Like, it's too many. I can just get another one. <laughs> See, like, it, it's just that. I wish that a lot of women knew that. Niggas is everywhere. What she said? How you let them cheat and take them back? Must, must be your only, only nigga. nigga. What? Could never. But you know, I did back in the day. But nowadays, now, today? Now, I ain't gonna lie. I have my fair share of being the Lulu <laughs> and just being like, oh, it's okay. We go through ups and downs. No. Ups and no. downs is not cheating, ladies. No, it's not. Because no, you not. wouldn't cheat on your nigga. Exactly. And don't be like, yeah, I cheat on my nigga. When you cheated on him, after he cheated on you? Did you really want to do that? You did that to make yourself feel better. You did it because you thought it was going to make him hurt, but really made your bodies go up and the nigga still ain't give a fuck about you. And now so, he think you a bop. Like, no. Just, just cut him loose. Mm-mm. Cut him loose. Cut him. Mm-mm. Speaking of cutting shit loose, we got to say RIP to TikTok, man. TikTok is getting banned, my friends. And you are a TikTok girl. Yeah. So I do want to ask you, how do you feel about that? I don't, I think that's so dumb. Like, it's so much other shit going on in the U.S. that needs, like, immediate attention. Immediately. And y'all want to be on TikTok? Like, what's really going on? Like, you what know the what's fuck, going what on. the fuck y'all got going on? Like, that shit don't make no sense. People. And it's like, that's how a lot of, that's how a lot of people make money these days. And you want to take that away? Like, niggas is already struggling. You want to make it worse? Like, yeah. mm, it's the, weird. It's very weird. And do you think, like, what, do you think that is going to impact you and your audience with just y'all connection and how do you feel like it's going to oh. impact that since TikTok is going away? I ain't going to lie. No, but I think what it would affect is, like, the opportunities that I would get in the future, like of reaching newer people, because you know TikTok is a worldwide thing. Mm-hmm. So, you know, like if you're on the for you page, like I could be reaching people in fucking like Russia, China, Japan. Mm-hmm. But if they taking that away, like that kind of eliminates that. So, but I'm not really worried about it. I'm more of an IG girly, anyways. And I'm trying to venture out into different platforms because mm-hmm. TikTok, like, it's been a yeah. Um, so yeah. So yeah. it's like you gotta find new things to do. Yeah. So what you saying that you are venturing out into Instagram? So you finna start doing more like reels? Are you gonna be doing more? You know, going on live? Like what you gonna do? Cause bitch, I follow you on Instagram, and you really don't be posting like that. And I was trying to stalk your ass, and I couldn't even find shit about her, bro. Because like I be trying to be mysterious, right? <laughs> but. I'm a certified yapper. So exactly. It's really, hard. I was it's say. really hard. Like, I'm trying to be like that, but that's not who I am. Like, I just be talking, I be talking, I be talking. But I really want to get more into YouTube mm-hmm. because my life is really crazy. Like, my life is really insane. And it's a lot of things that I just don't feel the need to, like, share with everybody. Mm-hmm. But when I tell the stories to, like, my friends and stuff, and they be like, this is a whole, like, movie. Like, what the fuck? Right. Like, let's so, do a story time. Like, yeah. Get ready with me story time. Like, what are you talking about? I think, because with the, with the stuff I'm about to start doing, like, you know, with music and acting and stuff like that, like, I really want to document that. Not only just to show people, but just kind of like, you know, when I do get to that other level, I'll be able to look back on it and just, like, see my growth. Because, like, I'm all about growth. That's good. And since you are all about growing... Let's get into more of self. Let's learn more about the Ivy, okay? So, I did want to let everybody know if they didn't already know. My bitch definitely was on that field, baby. Running on that track in high school and in college. Yeah. Don't play with her. And I did want to just say this. I did know you in high school, but you were really, really quiet. Yeah, you always had that curly, big-ass hair. hmm and you was quiet in the bitch, but you ran fast as fuck. Mm-hmm. So now seeing you and growing and being this influencer and just being so outspoken and everything is very... I love that for you because you really came out your shell. Like, what Thank made you, you be like, okay, done with the bullshit. Like, I'm coming out. I think, honestly, it was COVID. 
because what happened? It was spring break. I had track practice at school one day, and coach was like, no, y'all can't come to practice. Y'all got to go home. Like, they got this disease going around. And I'm just like, oh, okay, cool. Like, okay, I'll be back in a week or two. Maybe the whole school year ended. No prom. I'm still mad about that. I'm uh, still mad I didn't get a fucking prom. Uh, Every time prom com- comes around, I be mad jealous. Oh, God, I be mad too. I be jealous. I had a prom. I just didn't go. And fuck that nigga who went with that bitch. Oh. But go ahead. <laughs> yeah, but I think COVID, being on lockdown, I was really just in my house every fucking day. And I kind of already had the mindset when I was in school of like, I'm going to be something one day. But I just yeah. don't know what it is. And I low key, I really what it is, I'm I'm really insane. Like I'm delusional. It's and good to be delusional. <laughs> it's not delusion. It's called manifestation. That's what yes. I want people to understand. Manifestation. That's what it life. is. But like I think I remember being in high school and I would post on Instagram and I wouldn't put no captions, nothing. And the reason why I did that because I was like, hmm, Beyonce do that. So <laughs> I'm gonna do it too and see what happens. And that shit was actually working. Like people was fucking with it. I was getting like a thousand likes and stuff. I was just like, okay. So then like I signed to the school that I went to my freshman year. Mm-hmm. You know, I had my little hype video. People supported me like, oh, she going off to school. Like, that's great. Mm-hmm. And when I got there, like that's really when everything just kind of blew up like I was doing I was doing okay because I transferred to another school Fort Scott like that's my home like everybody mm-hmm. there like that's family for real Her. but when I was at my uh, original school I just kind of posted a picture like I was in my uniform I had just won a race I was feeling good you know I'm a little cute and so I'm in my uniform I'm just like yeah like big ivy what's up and the post just blew up like I don't know why but it just did and beautiful ballers posted me. I don't even know who that was, but they got a lot. Yeah, of, they got yeah. that shit. Yeah, they got that shit. So they posted me, and after that, like I started getting brand deals. I started getting all type of people contacting me, and from there, like that just kind of basically slingshot me into like what I'm doing now. Mm-hmm. And I think it really took. It's a shame that it took that, but that's just kind of what it is. It really took other people constantly telling me like, I mean, you really like. You're really like that for real. Like, you can really be somebody. You're her. Like, yeah. Because I struggled with, I really struggled with my self-esteem for right. a long time, which is really why I was so quiet in high school. Yeah. But I, it took, like, people constantly telling me, like, I don't even know why you like that for real. Because you're for really real. You're is. beautiful. Like, bro, <laughs> I always used to see her. She was so beautiful. Like, thank you. Bro. And then she could run. And then the body body. It was just like, she had the hair. She had everything. She was... The smile, she was, and then she was so nice. It was pure, you know what I'm saying? Like you say, now that you say that, I can see that. Yeah. I can see that, that you didn't grow into yourself. Now that you have grown into yourself, you are more beautiful than what you already were. But once you do step into yourself, I tell everybody that y'all don't understand. Y'all really are her. Like, you got to believe in yourself before anybody, before you really can take it in. But it do take other people to show you before you really can see. Yeah. But I'm glad that you did see that for yourself because, bro, you finna go up, like, for sure. for sure. When did you start doing music? It's crazy how this shit started. I ain't gonna lie. So I've always loved music. Mm. When I was little, I used to lock myself in my room and sing Demi Lovato and Miley Cyrus mm. real bad. I was on Disney Channel real bad. real bad. But the thing about that is I couldn't fucking sing. So I didn't want nobody to hear me. <laughs> if somebody was like, I be seeing, I'm just like, no, what the fuck? So I got to college and, you know, like my love for music is still there. Period. And one day, some niggas on my track team decided they was going to do a diss track on everybody. Everybody got the smoke. And I was actually in the room when I got name dropped on a oh. diss track. I'm not they name dropping. This, this nigga sitting here recording. Da, 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 da. Hey, yo, Ivy, what's up? Is you chilling or you want to fuck? I'm sitting in the room like, I know you fucking lying. <laughs> Me, I know Ivy? you fucking lying. And he's trying to clock my T on the song too. So I was like, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Like, 
y'all got me fucked up. Like, y'all can talk about all these other hoes, but me, first of all, I'm the only hoe standing here. I'm not a hoe, but you know, I'm you the know, only girl I'm standing only girl up in here. And you really think you finna do me like that? I was like, bet. So in 10 minutes, I wrote my little verse <laughs> and I was like, y'all gonna put me on a song, right? And they're like, yeah, I, right, you don't know how to, you don't know how to rap for real. Do, 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 do. I'm just like, okay, cool. So I get on the mic and I drop my verse and I ain't gonna lie, I ran that hoe. Okay. I very much ran that hoe. I, I was name dropping. I cleared everybody. <laughs> everybody had something to say about me. Even people who didn't have didn't nothing to say, to say but could get the smoke. Like, okay. they got it. Basically. Like, they got it. And when I got done, you can hear it on the track too. Like, it's in my phone. But when I got done, I looked around, I turned around. All the niggas was in the room like, and everybody just started screaming. That's <laughs> everybody just started screaming. They was like, what the fuck? Why you read that like that? I'm just like, y'all had me fucked up. I was like, what like, you mean? When somebody got you fucked up, you gonna put that pen to work. So, I'm so you. that's really how it started. And then eventually it turned into me taking things that I've been through and just putting it into music. Mm -hmm. And now I'm kind of like, I started off just writing, you know, like having shit in my notes, but now I'm kind of at the point to where like, I just put the headphones on and whatever comes out, like that's just what comes out and people fuck with it. So, I do. I fuck with it. <laughs> Thank you. Still need her to drop that yeah. song, but you know. So, 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 so in due time. In so, due time. it's gonna come. It's gonna come. It's not gonna come, y'all. But would you say, since you say you are a rapper, would you say that you're more of an alt rapper? You just hip hop, period? Or like, what kind of genre would you place yourself in? I ain't gonna lie. I'm real versatile. Mm -hmm. Like, people. Put her on a beat, she gonna wreck it. Pretty yeah. much. Pretty <laughs> much. But I, it's like, imagine like, you know, under some underground type of shit. Mm -hmm. But people tell me like, oh, but you look like, like a mainstream type of girl. Like you just right. have that, you have that look. So I feel like it's different for me because I'm just kind of like, it's weird, but like it is what it is. And I'm good at this shit. So yeah. like, yeah, that's just what I'm doing. That's really good. So I'm really surprised because you really cooled in a bitch. And I'm not saying that she was gonna be like, you know, but you know how them influences. No, be. look, I get that a lot. Even in high school, before all this influencer shit even started, people would be like, I ain't gonna lie, I thought you was gonna be stuck up or something, but you're actually really cool. I thought you were a bitch at first. I'm just like, story of my life. I don't know <laughs> why. I don't know why. I think it's just because how I look. And honestly, I have resting bitch face, like real bad. Like, people see me and I just be like, True. And they be like, damn, you look like you mad or you sad. I'm just like, bro, that's to my face. I'm really cool. I'm really nice. Like, I'm a nice girl. <laughs> yeah, people want you to be walking around like, yeah, like, no. no. I, I'm, <laughs> she I'm, did. I'm just chilling, bro. Like, I'm just vibe. Like, and she is a vibe. Is. She really is a vibe. Yeah, She's a vibe very all genuine, the time. very pure, funny than a bitch. And just to close everything out, y'all. What is some of the future career goals that you have for yourself? Like, what do we have next to see for you? Honestly, I'm the type of person to go where the wind take me. <laughs> but I do have goals. And I think one of the things that I've really just been thinking about and manifesting for myself is doing, like, a performance, like, on a stage, like, with my music. Yeah. Because... It's too many people who fuck with it for me not it to It needs get a, to be heard. Like, I got to get a people a show, like... <laughs> Immediately. You know yeah. what? I'm glad that you said that. Because I might, I might have something for you. Oh. I might have something okay. for you, baby, in a little age, okay? No facts, for real. Have you ever heard of First to the Future? Mm-mm. Okay, First... I'm a... Okay. okay. First to the Future, y'all. <laughs> she gonna be there performing, okay? So... We closing everything out. <laughs> and don't forget to follow me at Ken Juvie. Don't forget to follow Off Top TV. And don't forget to follow. Follow me at Iviana. It's with two V's though. It's I V V Y A N N A. All right, y'all. Bye.